His heritage in these mountains runs deep. An eighth generation resident of the 11th district. His ancestors served our Western North Carolina towns and communities for over 200 years. His grandfather, six generations back, fought in the Revolutionary War for the Colonial Army and later donated land in Hendersonville, where Mud Creek Baptist Church still stands. He is Madison Cawthorn, raised in Hendersonville. He planned on serving his country in the Navy with a nomination to the U.S. Naval Academy in Annapolis. But all that changed in the spring of 2014 when tragedy struck. When 19-year-old Madison Cawthorn's recovery after he nearly died in a car crash outside Orlando. He was in a terrible car accident in Daytona, Florida. The vehicle slammed into a concrete pylon and burst into flames. I uh, received a phone call and it was on her Priscilla's cell phone. They didn't think he was gonna make it. The injuries just got worse and worse. So what do you have? He had a broken foot, third degree burns on one leg, uh, vertebrae broken at T12 the lower back, all of his intestines pushed up to a diaphragm. Like she said, two collapsed lungs, one kidney ripped off. And his broke, pelvis was broken. Broke, broken in two places, the pelvis. So he was pretty busted up. God sustained us and he just carried us. He was in ICU for five weeks. Many times, you know, life and death for the first several weeks. It's, it's been a long and hard recovery and he has, he has fought every step of the way. But I knew Madison's heart, I knew his spirit, and I knew that he could do it and that if anybody could do it, Madison could do it. His life-threatening injuries tested his determination, faith, and courage in ways very few will ever face. It's been a long and sometimes grueling road back to health, but today, Six years later, Madison inspires a generation of young Americans to live out their faith, work hard, play by the rules, and pursue the American dream. And now, he's ready to take on the liberals in Congress. I was born and raised here in the 11th district. I can relate to people who feel like they've been dealt a bad hand, who feel like they've been left behind, disenfranchised, whose dreams have been crushed, who feel all alone. To those who are struggling just to make it, I say I hear you and I can relate to you. I'm a millennial. I represent an emerging generation of Americans who are tomorrow's leaders, most of whom think the Republicans don't care about the disenfranchised, the hurting, and those less fortunate. But nothing can be farther from the truth. We are the party of Abraham Lincoln and Ronald Reagan. We are the party who ended slavery, brought down the Berlin Wall and the Iron Curtain. We are the party who stands up for dignity of the individual, for life, for liberty, and for freedom. I'm Madison Cawthorn, and I believe America is worth fighting for. Our faith, our freedoms, and our American values are under assault. Leftists like Nancy Pelosi and AOC. I'm pro-Trump, pro-life, and pro-Second Amendment. I'm a fighter. Like so many of you, I've known great adversity, and I'll be a strong voice for faith, family, and freedom.